We're here at about the 19 mile marker on Padre Island National Seashore with Nick Meyer from Breakaway Tackle. Catching pompanos. Good time of year for it. The water's pretty clear. The bait we use is a little piece of fish bite fishing strips with a small piece of uh, dead shrimp on it. Using a double drop rig today and first one out. We caught two with one, one cast. Looks like Nick's got one on here. It's real interesting to watch them pumping out run sideways. The minute you get them near shallow water, off they go. Yeah. You can always tell it's a pompano because, as Nick's saying, when they get near the surf, they start swimming sideways. And that's what we're going for today. Excellent eating fish, and they're here every winter, every winter and spring. They're actually here more often than that, but this is what most people target them. One of the reasons we stopped here at the 19 mile marker is all these little coquina shells. These are one of the, uh, part of the diet of the pompano and of other fish. And you'll see them in the, in the sand moving around. There's some over here. Yeah, see them moving? See them moving? A couple of points I want to look at, Davey, is the fact that I've got this reel in the low position. Most people have the reel set up here. This is an adjustable reel seat which we use which we can move in the up position. So if I wanted a cast like that, I could. But because I've got a shoulder injury, we use the back cast in the low position reel. And now I can cast using my legs rather than my upper shoulder. Let her rip. Perfect. That's where they live. Well, the thing when you put your rod in the sand spike, don't over tighten the line because a lot of people now cast out, tighten up, and all you do is pull a sink around the sand and it rolls down the beach. So leave it to set. When you're actually holding the pompano, grab him deep in the gills. There's a couple of points you've got to watch out for. You've got some really nasty spines here that will cut you, and you've got five of them on top here, and they're very sharp. So be careful, because if they rake you, they will open your hands up. All right, good so, advice, good advice. 